Hi you guys, happy Sunday. So, you know, last couple days have been pretty difficult for me. So, the thing that I used to love doing is doing nice things for other people. And I haven't been able to do that lately because I pretty much have had to be leaning on other people to survive. Free bags and cards. And so Bailey and I are just gonna give them to people that are good people like you guys. Since I can't give you guys anything to show how much I appreciate what you've done for me and how every day you make me feel better, I'm going to do this as if I'm giving it to all you guys. And doing good things for other people always makes you feel good. First stop, we're at Tim Hortons so I can pay for my second, co my coffee from yesterday, my one from today. And this treat bag is going to the girl that helped me yesterday by letting me drive around. I had to give the treat bag to the girl at the window because the girl from yesterday wasn't there. But <laughs> I could hear the lady behind me placing her order. You know how you can hear the one behind you. But listen, I'm going to tell you right now, it's not only us that's having a hard time, you know, with the 2018 kick in the face start. Because <laughs> the girl said, okay, is there anything else? <laughs> the lady goes... <laughs> Unless you got vodka back there, I'm fine. <laughs> Since most of you that support me are dog lovers, I am going to leave a random card, Happy Sunday, on one of the cards because these are all people at the dog park. Have a great day and never forget to be kind. Dog people are the best people. I'm going to put this on a random car's windshield. Okay, I went with this Mazda 3. Hopefully they like it. <laughs> okay, our next stop is going to be at the Windsor Street Exchange. Now that is a place there's always people panhandling for money. I know how it feels to need to get other people to help you. And a lot of people give them a hard time, but listen, it doesn't matter. Rain, snow, whatever. Those people are there. So I'm going to give a bag of candy. I hope you have a great day and never forget you are amazing. Keep moving forward. This time I signed Diane and Bailey because a lot of them have dogs and they're probably the best dog owners in the world. Hi, honey. Hello. Listen, you like candies? Yes, I do. Take them candies. Oh, thank you. You have a good day. It's cold out, eh? Yes, it is. You got to help each other. Yeah, people come by and laugh at me, make fun of me. Like, you're not in my shoes. That's right. And you you know what? Nobody else thank will be you. out here. You're 24 hours. Thank you. See you. See, what is wrong with people giving people a hard time? Anyway, God love her. She's going to have some candy, and it's going to be a good day. Now I'm headed to another friend. She's given me a lot of advice. Emotionally, everyone's been so supportive of me. Give her some candy. She's always on a diet, but, you know, it's a thought that counts. Next, we're going to go see my best friend since elementary school. And we grew up together. ADHD, at the end of the day, she got my back and I got hers. Like, it doesn't matter what out of control situation happens. She, she got me. You know what I mean? She got me. She <laughs> is one of the strongest people I know. She's a single mom. She has two boys. She, you know, survives every day, right? We keep going, we support each other, and she's that person. Here's Michelle. That's my girl. Thanks for the candy. I love candy. There's our, there are those friends out there. Okay, and now we're headed to Hillary. I have been using Hillary as basically a secretary. And, you know, because there are certain things that I don't know how to do, and she just does them, and she's really good at it. She's just a good person. She is the one that gave me her boyfriend's rain suit. Good people. She's only young, so she's probably still sleeping. We just leave that in her door. I just got back in the car, leaving Hillary's, and I run into this guy I went to high school with. And he's been following my videos, and he lives in Ottawa, but he's here visiting his parents. And I'm gonna tell you right now, it was so good to see him. He is the kindest, nicest, most genuine guy. If I like boys and he liked girls, I'd be after him, I would. 
because he he is just the epitome of kindness he gave me a hug and it was a hug you know what i mean when someone gives you a hug they're not tapping you on the shoulder that man gave me a hug and he's been through stuff he makes it every day he supports me emotionally through my videos and he understands what i'm going through he didn't want nothing from me just a good solid guy those are the people you need in your life now we're headed to Susie's mom trish i always say that people that own goldens have golden hearts trish is a prime example of a golden heart she is what people should strive to be just a good person i'm just thankful for you trish and i'm just thankful for Susie and you letting me be part of her life and your life and trish doesn't judge anyone she's just genuinely a good person unfortunately the card that i had for my friend trish i spilt my coffee all over she's it. going to get just a random piece of paper so she'll hopefully eat the candies and not think they're from a stranger now i'm going to bring the final bag of candy that i had miss tina when i was getting my class to be licensed was miss tina now that girl is no bigger than a napkin she can, she can park that bus she lives on a dirt road for one let's start there dirt road she backs the bus up. It goes her house, the bus, her garage, her car, her fence. She says, imagine no pressure at all. Don't hit anything. It's the people like her in a company who's actually the one making the difference. She cares about her job. She cares about her kids. She cares about me and that, and that I am comfortable and you know trained properly and i i owe her a lot because i've been in a real uncomfortable place her, her focus was me and my goal and she brought me to my goal i really would like to drive a dump truck or anything big really so if anyone out there you know wants to offer me a job like i am tina approved look how close everything is so I put it up on her dash. Okay, that's it. We have no candy left. We're headed home. And do good things for other people because that's that's what you know life really is about. Taking care of each other. You guys know how much you guys mean to me, and I wish I could have gave candy to everyone. But please know that. Everyone I gave candy to, it was on behalf of all of you, and I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for being in my life, and thank you for caring about me and helping me get through this hard time. I love you guys.